The prophets of Baal are the ones that chanted and grunted over a sacrifice that never got burned, right? So Christians, when you feverishly invoke doctrines of demons and destructive heresies and claim that the reason why you don't have your breakthrough is because there is an altar erected against you from some person in the occult, a member in your family, a friend. Yeah, and if you don't bring this like low, if you don't cast this out of the room, you ain't gonna get your answer prayer. First of all, you leave out a whole bunch of people that don't have access to that strange doctrine that is not in the Bible. And secondly, you make sure that you look like a chanting, grunting prophet of Baal when your answered prayer does not come through despite all of the rituals that you do in order to conquer. The rituals of which involve Christian principles. So all of your fasting, all of your praying, all of your random insistences that this year is me basically handling the occult guys when you do that and you don't get answered prayer it's largely because god is not yet giving you a husband he's not yet giving you a job he has made you wait in patience enduring evil patiently that you might ultimately be redeemed out of your sorrow after suffering for a little while and then god will glorify you later that's what he's doing but when you try to grant you make him look like Baal. Like stop, it's unbiblical. 